Hello, good morning. This is Chris Menard. Hope everyone's having a good weekend. This is going to be a really short video. I'm in Microsoft Word, but this will apply to Word, Outlook, PowerPoint, and Excel. Microsoft's heard our comments about insert and icons. So when you go to insert icons, which is under illustrations, They've added more icons, but they've also put in here the ability to search for these icons. These icons are SVG format, that scalable vector graphic. What's nice about it is once you put it in, you can change the color, you can resize it, uh, and you can rotate it. And it doesn't matter what you do to it, it always looks great. So, the way it's worked in the past is when I came here and select business, it would be on the business category, and then I scroll down, and then it should be the next one should be celebration, which is right here. But I don't want to sit here and have to scroll through here. There's hundreds of them. I know I need an icon of people. So, if I just type in people, there are all the icons for people. If I need a chart, I'm just going to type in chart. I'm going to go ahead and pick one. I'm just making this up. Let's say revenue was way up, so I want to use this one right here. Click on insert, and it'll insert it in your document. And then from here, you can come and change it and do whatever you want to with it. I'm going to make it square. Put it over here. I told you you can rotate it. There's rotate. This is probably not the best one to rotate. I told you you can change the color. So once you've inserted it's graphic formats. That is a contextual tab that appears because the icon is selected. If I click off the icon, it goes away. Fill, and this is really cool that they did this. Live preview still works. So I'm going to start mousing over the colors slowly. I'm not clicking. I'm just moving the mouse over them. And you can see that it's changing. I'm going to go with this green. And then I told you you can also resize it and it'll still look good and that's absolutely the case. So there you go. So again, I'm in Word doing this, but it works in Word, PowerPoint, Excel, and Outlook. It's the same place. One more trick with these, you can also, let me find a blank space to do this at. When you go to insert icons, and I'm gonna do another search, um, Go back to people. You can come over here and click, click. You can do multiple icons at one time. So I'm going to insert four icons. There they are. And what's nice is they're not even on top of each other. So again, you can change it and move them around, change the colors. And coming up, that is it for today. Coming up is a major new feature in Microsoft Outlook. If you notice, I popped over into my Outlook. I want to point out right up here where my mouse is moving, and I'll put a rectangle around here. You probably have search right here in your desktop version of Outlook. If you notice, I don't. They have moved search up into the title bar. And they've actually redefined how search works. This is really cool what they're doing here. Search is a lot faster. Um, it's, a lot, it's a lot better organized. Do I want to search only for attachments? I hit yes. I hit search. Watch how fast this works. I've got thousands of emails. It only found attachments. You can even come in here and add more options. It is very accurate and very fast. I'm going to cover that in my next video, which will be in about 20 minutes. Have a great Sunday. Thank you.